So the mission is showing sets and resets in CX Programmer. So we've already got a basic couple of inputs coming in here from the S1 and S2 ultrasonics, driving the work bit. We'll start down in the next row with that work bit. Create a contact. And then this will drive a, a set instruction. So we'll set a bit whenever this comes on. And then even if it goes off, it'll stay set. Um, I'll just get back into that. So there's the set instruction. You go down to details and go into fill in the operands here. Um, we can do it a few different ways, but if we just use the mouse clicking through, uh, the one we want to set is the output bit, which was 100.00 for this one. R1 stop driven off. So that is it's come in there. You could also enter it directly in there by just typing in. Um, and if you do need help on the instruction, this is a very useful button just here. Instruction help for any sort of instruction that you want to put in. Click on that and you'll get a good oh, yep. help file which you can go through and I'll have examples down the bottom of how to use it. So this right. shows you actual code. And to go for your reset section, you type in R set and the detail, was it? Instead of where you typed in set originally? Yes. Yeah, right. Eh? Okay. Yep. So I'll put that in there. So it's gone uh, clear now. So it's all right. Um, I'll just use, you can use this horizontal to join things up, but then you have to push one at a time. So I'll use this one, which you can drag. Ah, oh, yep. And put it together. And then we'll do a reset the same way. So uh, this one, which button will be the reset again here? So the resets are all these here. So it's 004 oh, is yep. P1. So 00, oops, 00.04, right? Oh, yeah. oh no, sorry mate, you got too many zeros now. Yeah, zero now, you're zero right. now you're right. Yep. Okay. 0 0.04 to... That's P1. Oh yeah, so that's P1 and then all four of them. Five. Either B6. any of the four, oh no, all four of them have to be set, have to be pushed before they can reset, right? Before it'll reset, yes. Okay. Yep. Oh, well, and let's it just. Does, it doesn't matter whether or not we're going um, S1, S2, or S3, S4, they all have to be pushed to make any movement reset. Sure. Just to keep things simple for the set and reset, we'll just go with one for now. And um, we'll do that where any of the all of the four have to be pushed later okay so then we'll do the next instruction which is reset go into detail instruction output it was rst wasn't it yeah yeah now we should uh, instruction no r e r e t wasn't it uh r e c t i thought it was d oh no Maybe I'll try set. Go with instruction help. Oh, okay, it was R E C T. So then I can enter the operand of which one I want to reset. It's the same bit as we were using before. It's 100.00. And push OK. And go to that line here and join it up. Okay, now, so on that part there, can you have that resetting 00? zero 100 and the other one, 00, uh, 100.01. Can you make that reset that as well? No, I think you need a separate instruction for that. Right. So, um, you could have a separate instruction just down here, I think. Might want to try that. Anyway, 